I'm Josh with Woodland Mills and this video is for customers considering our universal mounting brackets to work with our multi-lander trailer. So the universal mounting brackets, it's three components. So there's a front yoke, you'll see it in gray here, and you'll see how it wraps around this piece of dimensional lumber. It also has a saddle and a locking pin which keeps the front down and secure on the frame. Same goes on this side, dimensional lumber fits in and this actually pinches the lumber to hold it tight once the bolts are in place. As we go around to the back, I'll show it's two separate brackets and they mount on that same dimensional lumber as it comes out the back. So you'll see it's just this vertical piece that fits in with our uh, the hinge point which is already on the multi-lander and then it has the two bolts that pinch onto the one and a half inch dimensional lumber. Again two at the back. If you need to stiffen your frame up you can add multiple layers of dimensional lumber and you'll just have to get longer bolts. With this kit you can take the multi-lander and build any type of deck you want. The limitation is the 2,000 pound capacity of the multi-lander itself. So we're showing it here with a small hay wagon top. This has been built with uh, materials from a local lumber yard. And obviously this could be expanded in width and length uh, to meet the track width of the multi-lander. You could also come up with your own configurations for your own uses. Uh, if you wanted to mount a, a pump and a hose reel or a water tank, you can build your own decks utilizing those brackets to make the most of the multi-lander for your acreage. I've gone ahead and put our boom and winch kit to show it in combination with the universal mounting brackets. Uh, with the boom and winch you're going to be able to take whatever you've built on top of those brackets and dump it. Depending on its size and shape the angle will vary but I'll show you how by using the tilting boom, by removing the pin, and the telescopic feature, you're going to be able to reach your maximum dumping angle for whatever you've built on those brackets. So now you'll see that if there was a load on here, we could have dumped it off. You'll also see some of the details of how the universal mounts clamp on the dimensional lumber. Uh, the brackets and the bolts are supplied. And if you need to reinforce, you could add another layer of wood on the left or the right, depending on the load um, you're trying to carry um, for the mount you're making for the trailer.